She's a successful businesswoman who has won numerous awards, including the prestigious Global Unsung Heroine Award. She's the founder of Up With Women, an organization dedicated to helping homeless women and children. Leah Gramanis joins us this morning. She's in Calgary to help raise funds for the YWCA and the Discovery House. Thanks for joining us, Leah. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Well, let's talk a little bit about Up With Women and how you became involved in that. Well, Up With Women is really the result of a, an 18-year-old promise. 18 years ago, I, I lived in a shelter, and I had to escape an abusive household. If it wasn't for the shelter, I don't know if I'd be alive today. Mm -hmm. So uh, I made that promise because I didn't have anybody mm -hmm. who would come into my shelter to say, I was here too, and look where I am now. You can get here. And so uh, as a result of that, I decided that I was going to find a whole bunch of women who have all become extraordinarily successful and uh, were all once homeless to really give hope, not yeah. just to homeless women today, but also to uh, the general public and really educate them and show them that success belongs to everybody and homelessness is not a dead end. If the services are there, people can have the help they need. So how does Up With Women get uh, involved in this? How, what is that uh, all about? Up With Women, uh, basically what we do is we uh, help homeless women and children to rebuild their lives by providing them the, the knowledge and the strategies that we've learned to build a life from nothing, okay. really. Uh, we also, of course, support... Uh, the shelters, we do a lot of public education, we work mm -hmm. a lot with the media to really get our stories out there because sometimes all it takes is just a little mm -hmm. bit of proof that you can do it too. Now it's interesting because we report on domestic violence pretty much on a regular basis, almost weekly that there's a story out there. You've been working in this industry for, for a while. Have you seen growth? Have you seen some possibilities there for people? Yeah, you know, I, I have to say that compared to 20 years ago, we're certainly doing a lot better. The mm -hmm. police are better educated. You know, when I was, uh, when I had my life threatened, mm -hmm. the police did nothing. And, uh, and I've actually seen how well that they can do now. Uh, but we still have a long way to go. I mean, in, in Alberta, 12,000 yeah. women and children are accepted into shelters. But unfortunately, 14,000 of them are turned away. Mm. And, you know, as a woman who... Uh, doesn't know if she would have seen her 20th year had it not been for yeah. that shelter, had that shelter not been there for me, that kills me inside. Okay, let's talk about how Calgarians can help. Let's talk about this ch challenge and donations. Yeah, okay. Well, uh, I am, uh, I am uh, putting an, a big challenge out to Calgarians. We've done this very successfully in Toronto. I'm here from Toronto, and, uh, and we've been able to raise a lot of money. I am personally uh, offering to match up to $10,000 worth of wow. donations that will come through our website at upwithwomen.com. There's the Calgary Challenge right on the front page. Mm -hmm. And uh, I want Calgarians to show us what they're made of. Pull some money out of my pocket and, uh, <laughs> and show us that you really care about okay. shelters. So it is going to go to Discovery House and the YWCA. They're incredible organizations. I've worked with both of them. They certainly are. And what a great challenge, Leah. Thanks for bringing that to us. And uh, hopefully Calgarians can uh, uh, check out the website and uh, open their wallets. Thanks Quite again, good. Leah. Thank you.